Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at Hands Down from the Other Brothers and Vanishing Incorporated. What is Hands Down? Basically, it's an impromptu trick that you can do either with a coin or a post-it note. It's a in the hands routine where the spectator puts the object behind their back, they switch hands multiple times, and then you are able to decipher which hand the object is in. You wanna see what the trailer looks like? This is it. It's pretty cool. Really I'm impressed. Yeah. That was good. This is a man's name? Yep. I'm getting a strong feeling from this hand. Is this a hand that has the paper? Open it up. If you like to wear men's underwear on occasion, switch hands. I want you to switch hands again. Do you hear that? Hey guys, I'm Daryl Williams. I'm Daryl Davis. We're the other brothers. This is hands down. This is a witch hand effect where the audience member can place something in their hand, pass it back and forth. You don't know where it is, but still the magician's able to divine which hand the object's in. It's all based on a very awesome principle that's used throughout the entire download. Many different presentations, many different ways to do it, many different situations. It is seriously something that we like and perform a lot. So I hope you guys enjoy. My name is Daryl and we're going to do some magic with somebody that you know, but think of somebody that I couldn't possibly know, okay? Okay. I want you to write their name down on this piece of paper. Don't let me see, okay? I'm going to look completely away. Write it nice and bold so that she can see it, but don't let me. Fold it in half and fold it in half again, okay? <laughs> you got it? Okay. Alright. Yeah. So to do this, I'm going to give you a piece of the paper, okay? Okay. The rest of this, we won't need. I want you to place the piece of paper in one of your hands okay. behind your back. Don't let me know which hand, okay? Okay. Now, thinking of this person, if they've ever given you a gift, I want you to switch hands. Don't let me see. Okay? If this per if you've ever written a card to this person, I want you to switch hands again. Don't let me see. Now, I don't know who this person is. I've never met them. I don't even know their name. But if you're holding the piece of paper in the hand that you write with, I want you to switch hands. Don't let me see. If this is a female, I want you to switch hands again, okay? Don't let me see. Close both hands tight. One of them's gonna hold the paper, the other one's not. But make sure they look exactly the same and bring them out in front of you just like this. Okay. I'm just gonna touch. Don't give me any indication which hand has the piece of paper. This is the hand with the paper. Open it up and show. There's the paper. Now, don't open it. Just think of the name. It starts with the letter M. Is that right? Mm -hmm. And this is a female. <laughs> I've never met her. Okay. The next time you see Marie, you tell her I said hi, okay? Ah! I'm good. <laughs> All right, so that was the other brothers. Uh, this trick is being released through Vanishing Incorporated. Okay, so some questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews. And the first of which is, what is in the box? What's in the box? You're getting a DVD. That's all you need. This is a mentalism trick. You don't need any props. You could do this totally propless. I would even argue you could do this without something in their hands. You could just have them mentally put something in their hands and switch it back and forth. I think this would be perfect for that. Um, the DVD is 22 minutes long and it costs $15. I think you get everything you need with this and let's get on into the review. Is it what I thought? Yes, it is what I thought. It is an impromptu witch hand effect. Witch hand effect, they put something in their hand, put it behind their back, they switch through a series of questions, and then when they bring it forward, you say left hand and you're right. So it, it's exactly what I uh, thought it would be. I've seen a couple of these different witch hand effects. Um, 
Peter Turner has one, but his is called Finger Finger. Uh, the, uh, he has another one, Peter Turner has another one where he has them stick an invisible coin in their hand and switch back and forth. So it, it, yeah, it, these kind of, there's a, this is kind of like a theme trick. So there's a series of these. And so yeah, I, it's kind of what I expected. What's the overall quality and production value of the DVD? Uh, the DVD has a couple of live shots where they actually perform this live in a bar, which is cool. Um, otherwise, it's a standing mounted camera and uh, Daryl Davis and Daryl Williams are standing against the backdrop and they're both together in the shot. So they're able to talk to each other, work and riff off of each other, and then also perform the trick for you. Then there's a couple of close-up shots, um, which is waist high, where you see what they're doing with their hands. But otherwise, it's pretty much those three shots. Um, well shot, well mic'd, it's fun to watch. It's a fun, enjoyable 22 minutes. How much practice does it require? Uh, of course, you're gonna have to remember the sequence you are able to make this trick a little bit more organic so that it fits your style with your own questions. So depending on the situation, uh, and I think you could even change up the questions from person to person. So you could actually you know, make this a, a live thing where you kind of riff off the person. Um, but you just have to remember the sequence mentally in your head. Uh, and I think the best way to practice this would probably be live. You know, you take it easy on the first couple people and then when you get familiar with the routining, and then you're able to do a little bit more of an impromptu kind of questions with the next person. And I think you'll just get better and better and better at it. If you've had any experience with um, billets and whatnot, you're gonna be right in the zone. You're gonna love this. Positives, all right, so some positives for hands down. This is sure fire. 100% hard hitting witch hand routine that is sure to please. And if you've already done um, a witch hand routine, I'm sure you'll switch out your old standard and, and pick this one in record time. Negatives, what are the negatives to hands down? None, there were no, no, no there's none, <laughs> there's no negatives to this whatsoever. I mean, $15, you can do this impromptu. It's a great witch hands routine that I think is 100% surefire. I mean, you're gonna hit every time. So it's no, no guesswork, it's perfect. 22 minutes long, you're not sitting there through hours trying to figure out what they're, it's not convoluted. You're like, yes, this is it. I got it, I love it. It's money well spent, 15 bucks. Is it worth your money? Yes, $15, go buy it. Uh, who would like this? If you're a mentalist, you do walk around. You already have a witch hands routine, you like it, but you'd like a better one, or you collect witch hands routines, I think you'll love the Other Brothers uh, take on this. All right. All right, so that is hands down from the Other Brothers and Vanishing Incorporated. And of course, I wanna thank Murphy's Magic for providing this trick for me so that I can review it for you. And if you would like to purchase your own, you can find it at your favorite Murphy's Magic retailer. Thanks, bye.